Hey ladies and gentlemen and welcome to GPU Digital and today we are going to have a look at the SightSync here. So what is SightSync? SightSync is a program that is developed by Samsung and it's only uh, and there's a th different versions um, so we can only take a look at the newest one but it is only supported for Samsung, the newer Samsung devices uh, SCS7 as as I made a video about it and you can check it out here. Well, uh, the first thing, of course, you're going to do is go going to start up SightSync on your own. And the way you do that is that you download SightSync on your com PC or your computer, and you also download it on the App Store. I will leave leave a link down to the where you can download some SightSync uh, on the computer down in the description, and also for your mobile device, just type in SightSync in the Google Store, and it will pop right up and download it from there. Now you will start up SightSync uh, on your computer. And you're gonna start up SightSync on the on your mobile device, and you will hopefully connect. Um, you do the procedure and push the buttons, of course, and so connected as we are here now. And as you can see, what it basically does is that you get a SightSync screen here. And what y you can do now is that you can open your screen on your phone. Oh, how lovely! It sounds very well incredible, but. It, this is actually quite useful. So, so now you ask, what can I do with SightSync? I can go on my phone, yeah. But what you can do, like, if you go up here, you can set, see the files and documents and images, and you could take these documents and transfer them directly to your PC without going into some fancy menu or into the file systems. Just here, you can put them over. Also, if we go back to the phone screen here again, um, yeah, you can click down here. <laughs> We go back the right way, and you control directly like it. You will control it normally, but you just it it is with a mouse, so it's a bit awkward. But it's okay. So what more can you do? You can actually do text messages, and you can take incoming calls, for example. Like if you have a friend who's writing you. So here my girlfriend is writing me, and I will answer her. Hey, I'll be home soon, or anything like that. She can actually also call you. So if you have a um, microphone connected to your PC. You can use your PC and use the microphone on your PC or your headset as it is with the headset for the what's it called? Yeah, mobile phone. So you don't have to plug it up to here and you can just use what uh, you normally use if you were talking like if you were talking on Skype and for me that's real real really lovely because I do a lot of talking at work or something like that. So I can actually just plug it in and be on my computer all day. I don't have to remove my headset or anything like that I have it all in my ears and I can just do it on the monitor not taking my eyes off my actual work while I'm talking and that's pretty neat and for me this is real real love and I use it a lot even when I'm at work or anything or like that I can just message fast I can use the keyboard on my PC to do the my meshing instead of having to do it with the small buttons and all that kind of stuff and it just goes a lot quicker and a lot faster and it's one of the reasons that I actually buy some a lot of Samsung devices compared to others because I have this side sync com availability of course you can still have side sync on your normal phone that's not a Samsung device but you won't be able to call people use that call function I don't know if you could be able to do the message function maybe you can test that out if you don't have a Samsung device uh, but again I just love it and you can do a lot of things and I would recommend everybody with a Samsung device to try it out and also you can uh, connect uh, SightSync uh, wirelessly if yeah if you have your laptop on the wireless you can just connect your through wireless as well but I always use a cord as I found it's much faster and the connection is much more reliable and you are yeah if you're gonna transfer any big documents or anything like that you, you will need a cable it's just so much faster um, but again I always use cable just to have that stable connection between my phone especially when I'm doing phone calls and anything like that but I recommend go try and, and try this out and I really like it um, I know it's a bit clumsy using your mouse as uh, where you normally use your fingers but again yeah try it out that's all from here and I really enjoy this uh, side thing and now you just got a little bit of what it can do and you can basically use it to control your whole phone so I will really like it so yeah that's all for GPG Digital I hope you like this uh, short video on what I side stick is and what do I use it for and why I like it so so that's all for now so uh, if you like this short video here then hit that like button or hit that subscribe button it really makes a lot also check all out some of my other videos um, so yeah that's all for GPG Digital hope you enjoy this so hope to see you again bye